when someone is diagnosed with cancer, it's important to know if and where the cancer has spread. This is called cancer staging. Following a lung cancer diagnosis, tests are done to check if and where cancer cells have spread to the lymph nodes. This is sometimes called nodal staging. In this video, we're taking a closer look at where the lymph nodes that are usually selected for testing are located. Lymph nodes are small organs found throughout your body. They are part of the immune system and help fight infections. Doctors often test the supraclavicular lymph nodes, which are above the collarbone, the mediastinal lymph nodes, which are in the middle of the chest, the subcarinal lymph nodes, which are below the trachea, where it divides into the left and right main bronchi, the hilar and intraparenchymal lymph nodes, which are on and around the lungs. Of note, lymph nodes in the armpit area, which are often tested for breast cancer, are not typically tested for lung cancer. To determine whether cancer cells have spread to lymph nodes, a biopsy of the lymph nodes is done. This is when tiny pieces of lymph nodes are taken and examined. Doctors look to see if they show any signs of cancer. The results will help your doctors offer you the best treatment plan. Here's what we have learned. Lymph nodes are normal parts of the human immune system. Lung cancer usually spreads to nearby lymph nodes first. Doctors test the lymph nodes near and around your lungs for signs of cancer. The results of these tests will help your doctors choose the best treatment plan for you. Every lung cancer is unique. Remember, talk to your care team if you have any questions or concerns. Navigating lung cancer can be challenging. The American Cancer Society is here to help. Visit the American Cancer Society website at cancer.org or call 1-800-227-2345.